well, about a week ago, I was about, about to give up on this uh, LCD here. I bought this one on uh, eBay to work with a project I'm working on. Uh, it's this, uh, this is the back side of it. It's the SY TFT240 version 1.1. This uh, comes with a um, SD card reader, touchscreen, and a 2.4 uh, inch LCD. You can see here I've got it running uh, with the uh, Yes, running off the SD card, displaying uh, pictures off of it. Uh, one of the other things I did with it too, to show the touchscreen works, is to uh, get the touchscreen going here. You can see there is how you set the set the clock. Going down back there. I was getting the touchscreen working. We could go to been happy just getting the uh, just getting the LCD itself working for the project I'm working on. But you can see here, I got the all all three aspects of it: the LCD, the SD card, and the touchscreen working all together uh, from it. Uh, biggest problem: it just there was wasn't seemed like there was very clear information out there on how this stupid thing was supposed to be wired. Every time I went to a page, it really didn't tell me what it, it told me the the pins, but it didn't tell me all of the uh, what pin go went where on the uh, Arduino. Uh, I was using the Arduino. Uh, Uno at first, but the Arduino Uno doesn't have enough memory really to uh, support these LCDs, so you really should do with the, me the Mega. And this, uh, the Arduino Uno had only uh, 32K, and this has 256K, so this is a lot better. It was just a hard, uh, hard to uh, get it working with it. Biggest problem was the uh, reset, the uh, right enable and all that it just didn't seem like it was very clear which pin that actually went to that it just was you know put these there and maybe it'll work and never could get it to work and then finally i found this page right here let's see if i can get a picture of it and this page right here uh definitely definitely helped on uh how to do it it has uh, a lot of the information on it, it has the sd the same same display that I have. Uh, some information of the, uh, the header. And this was the most important thing. This is what got me working. See? You can see that it tells you right where to put the pins. And uh, I'm telling you, as soon as I did that, the thing came alive. So these people here who wrote this know how to operate this. The only other thing you're going to need to do is get the UTFT drivers for it and the UTFT touch. Or U touch and the U fat for it. Is it U fat? And uh, load all those up and uh, it'll start working. Just follow the instructions. You know, if I'd have found, found this page sooner, I would have had this working a lot well, sooner than I, I did. But uh, you can see there's the clock. And these are all good demos for. Uh, to show all the aspects of how it works. And there it is. It's got the pictures going on it and everything.